Hey everyone, it's Coach Craig, CKs. We're gonna continue with our bunt defense coverage. Before we talked about a man on first, now we're gonna talk about man on first and second. So the bunt coverage does change a little bit here. All right, before we said the, the third baseman is gonna be reacting early as soon as he sees square. Here, the third baseman is not gonna be reacting early. All right, he's gonna come in, he's gonna kind of draw a line as I tell our players, draw a line, you know, pretend, you know, pretend there's a line on the ground, this is where you're gonna be. You're gonna kind of anchor yourself here. So we call this or the read and react play. So what's gonna happen here is the first baseman, as we'll explain after, he's gonna be the one charging where the third baseman is gonna be anchoring himself to the ground. And the reason that we wanna do that is we always talk about trying to get the lead runner if we can. So if the third baseman's anchored here and the ball is bunted somewhere away from him, he can simply retreat to third base, set up here as almost a first baseman, receive a throw and get the out. Now, on the opposite side of the coin, is if the ball is bunted hard by the pitcher to the, on the left side of the diamond or hard down the line here, the third baseman has to react to that ball. Right? We can't afford for that batter who's giving himself up to advance the runners to also reach first base successfully. All right? So if the third baseman reads it, and that's why we call it read and react, where he's got a break, he's got to come in, field the ball, then our play 100% of the time is going to be a first base. All right? We don't have third base co covered right now. So that's our, the way the third baseman is going to defend. That's where our defense is going to be set up to defend this play. The shortstop is going to do the same thing. He's going to rotate left in the, di in the diamond to go to second base. The first, uh, second baseman is going to rotate left to go to first base. Now I'm just going to slide over here real quick to the first base. Okay? So now, before, where the, fir where the first baseman was holding, especially at the older ages where they're leading, he's not going to be holding now. He's going to be on the grass, just like the third baseman was in the man on first only defense. So as soon as he sees square, he's going to charge, he's going to crash, he's going to get about two-thirds of the way like we talked about and set up here. The ball is bumping hard right here. It's an easy play, and we can now get down to third. Okay, now we got our whole bunk defense, our whole infield covered. There are other defenses that we can get into, which we'll talk about at a later date. Thanks for listening.